getting ready to take you on a journey so that you'll know why carbon is the most important element in the world and in the universe and why organic chemists are the coolest people on the planet. You might ask, what's so special about carbon? Sure, it has a tetrahedral geometry. Sure, it forms four bonds, but what's so special about carbon? Well, not only can carbon form four bonds, it likes to bond to itself. And when it does so, it can form long chains like this three carbon chain you see here. On paper, it just looks like three carbons connected together. But in real life, it's propane gas. If I add a fourth carbon, propane becomes butane. Oh, and those diamonds you like to rock, that's carbon the whole carbon and nothing but the carbon and that wouldn't be possible without carbon being able to bond to itself and form these lattices like you see here right? if you ever heard of nanoparticles or nanotubes those are made from carbon and there's even an area of medicine called nanomedicine where medications are being attached to nanotubes right all of this is possible because carbon can not only form single bonds but multiple bonds and those multiple bonds can even form rings like benzene that you see here even fatty acids and all types of exotic compounds have carbon as the backbone this is an example of DHA it's a fatty acid found in cold water oceanic fish and it's also known to stimulate brain function every blue dot that you see in the chain is a carbon let's talk about some other functional groups like ethers or alcohols that you can find here in THC tetrahydrocannabal the chemical in marijuana that makes you feel high or in heroin ester the ester functional group that you see here or formaldehyde which is an aldehyde the simplest aldehyde that exists as well as acetone which you'll run into in any nail shop in America even amino acids have a carbon backbone the nitrogen part is the amine and this part over here C double bond OOH that's your acid functional group and when you put those two together you get an amino acid those amino acids come together to form peptides DNA is just a polypeptide right DNA determines whether or not you have brown skin like India Ari or blue eyes or whether or not you have good hair or bad hair or you can just be like Nicki Minaj and defy DNA and have whatever color hair or eyes you want in a nutshell, everything comes down to chemistry and everything comes down to carbon. So no matter what your biology professors tell you, chemists are cooler and everything comes down to chemistry.